Hi everyone, my name is Marnie and I'm a speech language pathologist. I have my two-year-old son Aiden with me today and I'm having lots of fun watching him bloom and grow and and find all his words. You have lots of words. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's, so all I've been doing lately is being a repetitive model for him and he's getting all that information in his head and pretty soon he starts saying the words okay so let's try one oh, look who I see I see I see mommy 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 mama mama, <gasps> mama. I repeated myself I said it only two times. Let's try doing something else. Hmm, let's see. I just picked a pen. I wonder if I say it five times if he'll say it too. <gasps> pen! Pen! <gasps> pen! Pen? <gasps> pen! <gasps> pen! Yes, you said pen! No. <gasps> I have a choo-choo train. Choo-choo, choo-choo. I have a choo-choo train that says choo-choo. A choo-choo train. Choo-choo train. Choo-choo train. So as parents, the important thing is kids get the words in their life from our mouths, from our experiences that we give them. I'm the one who said, this is a choo-choo train. I could have said it was a bibbity bop and he would have believed me. But every night we play with his choo-choo train and now he actually has a name for his favorite toy. And I also today used the five times rule. I said pen, something I've never said to him in my life before. I said it five times. By the fifth time, he tried to approximate it. He said puh for pen. That felt good. Is there anything else that mommy can... <gasps> one last one. Let's try the five times rule with my... with my... this talk. My sock off, he actually said. We've been working on that. <gasps> sock! 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 <gasps> sock! Sock? Go off. Sock off! Oh, so a trick, yeah, he's showing me his toes and he said sock off. Aiden's sock off. The two tricks I did there, actually three tricks, and then we'll go night night again. First, I repeated myself. Then when he said two words, I said three words. First I copied him, sock off, and then I added one more, Aiden's sock off. So I'm sure by next month he'll be saying Aiden's sock off or my sock off. We'll be expanding the sentence. And the final trick I did is I waited. I just waited and I kept looking at him in anticipation. Whether or not he said it, I just wanted to be involved in what he was thinking and what he might say. Anyway, those are some tricks we're doing. And now he's going back to bed. Night night. Let's wave. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Night night. <laughs>